Hi, I'm Cook County Clerk David Orr. On October 1, 2003, the Cook County Domestic Partnership Registry was launched and 71 same-sex couples lined up to have their relationships officially recognized. Today, I'm happy to say, there are more than 1,500 gay and lesbian couples on the registry. In honor of the registry's fifth, fifth anniversary, my office created a video featuring four of those same-sex couples. Let's hear what they have to say. Um, I've been together about 12 and a half years. Do you remember? Yeah, 12 and a half years. <laughs> <laughs> and we did the domestic partner registry. Oh, I don't know how many years. Were we? Five years. That's five years ago? We were couple number 13. Yeah. That was so cool. I thought it was great that there was going to be a county recognition of our relationship. I understood perfectly well that it doesn't uh, give us any legal rights, but to have it officially recognized, it just made me feel good. And to have any kind of official sanctioning of it in the place where I live, in the home, my home county where I live, to have it recognized and registered, I, I wanted to do that. Yeah, when I heard about it, I definitely wanted to do it. Absolutely, because anything that would give us any sort of affirmation, some validation, recognition, I, I, I wanted to be there. I mean, I love California. I've never, been to, I've never been to Massachusetts. I go there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I would rather do it here. We want to wait until we're here. Yeah. I want it here. Um, I would work for it to come here. Um, I would support efforts to do it. I applaud, uh, you know, Greg Harris for doing the civil union thing um, and we hope that it will move us closer to marriage in the state of Illinois um, you know let's let's hope let's fight for it actually I mean it's like a, a beyond hope let's you know yeah. as long as we work for it as long as we're affirmatively working towards it um, I, uh, I, I I see that it would be in our future well we met in 1981 uh, which is now 27 years. When we first met, I, th I know I didn't know quite what to expect. It seemed like it was almost a new frontier. Uh, we certainly had fewer role models. There were some, and there were some long-term relationships, but most of the time what I observed was those relationships were only given partial kind of honor and partial support. And the more support and the more validation we get, I think the more that I want. Yeah. When we first got together in 1981, um, you know, things were there, were, there was a, there was a gay press, there was a gay community, there were gay activists, but it was all pretty much to the side. It was not involved in mainstream uh, politics in Chicago. It was probably sometime in the mid-90s or later after I was in the county clerk's office and Oak Park had passed uh, a recognition, a uh, domestic partner recognition or reg in registry, that I thought maybe this is something that Cook County could do. I spoke with Commissioner Quigley about moving forward with a registry and that finally happened in 2003. July 1st, 2003 was when it passed the county board. We uh, got married in Vancouver, British Columbia, because it was an opportunity and because it was important to us. And we, the first day of the domestic registry here, became domestically registered. Is that formal <laughs> <the> status? <laughs> became Be domestic part registered domestic partner. Because it's important. But there's an emotional component that I think, walking into it, you think, oh yeah, 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 this is important. I'm going to do it, but. It's not going to impact me. And then to be with other people, to be with our friends and to be with people we know and to have this recognition, it's just, it's been a tremendously emotionally kind of uh, just significant and wonderful experience. We met in 1993. We started dating, and we we built a solid friendship first, and we decided shortly, in pretty short order, really, that we wanted to be married. And we were married in a religious ceremony in 1995, and 
we've always told the guys, I and mean, we show them our wedding picture, and we talk about it as the day we became a family. The guys meaning our The children. guys meaning, yeah, these our guys, three our sons. three sons. Um, and it really is that day for me. It's what it meant. It was the day we started our family, even though they didn't come along until much later. In 1995, even having our wedding was a, it was new to our gay friends and it was definitely new to our uh, straight friends and family. You know, for Alex's part, you know, she's talked about having, you know, for com coming out for her was in part about sort of acknowledging that she wouldn't have kids, that that's what it meant. For me, coming out wasn't about saying goodbye to any of the possibilities. Any of the any any of those things, and so and I always wanted to be a mom. In so many ways, I kind of think we're just waiting for the paperwork to get caught up. You know, it's a formality almost at this point that we are as married as married can be. Clearly, you know, we've got these three little boys. This is as much of a family as you could ever possibly imagine it to be. And we went out on our first date, March 13th, 1982, I think. In fact, we was actually our first date was the, uh, we were polo matches at the, uh, what now is the Museum of Contemporary Art. And, um, and a month later, Roger moved in, and we've been together ever since. But I think for me, I don't even think the idea of government recognition of our relationships was even in the realm of imagination. It wasn't my vision. I just was happy to find somebody who I loved. And... Uh, and I'm still with that person who I love. It's absolutely amazing how fast the social movement of uh, securing the right to marry has occurred. Um, and there's been many steps along the way. People like uh, Commissioner Mike Quigley, who is the original sponsor of the domestic registry. People like uh, the Cook County Clerk, David Orr, who uh, implemented the registry. Uh, to various elected officials uh, who actually have got to know Roger and me as a couple and many same-sex couples. Uh, what they have done on this issue is, is so remarkable and I think so personally touching to all of us and we will forever be in their debts. Many of us, if not most of us in our community, We'll keep pushing until we actually have the right to marry. Congratulations to everyone on the fifth anniversary of the Domestic Partnership Registry. Uh, this may sound like a strange dream, but I'm hoping that someday, that as we know in Chicago politics, we lay everything at our children's feet. So that when my children or grandchildren take my seat, as is the custom, they're going to wonder what this was all about, and that future generations can love whomever they want, whenever they want, and they don't have to worry about people telling them what their rights are. God bless. The registry is hopefully just one step in the ongoing struggle for equal marriage rights for all. Happy anniversary to you all.